I am currently 30 weeks pregnant in two days. And for some reason this morning, around 7 a.m., my body started to do some weird things, like feeling like Braxton Hicks. And I'm just like, okay, just Braxton Hicks. 7.30 comes, wakes me up out of my sleep. I'm feeling pain again. Well, not really pain, but like, you know, slight, slight period pains, like slight period cramps. And um, I'm like, okay, so Braxton Hicks. 8 o'clock comes, I'm still feeling it like it woke me up again out of my sleep. And I'm like, this can't be normal. So here we are, waiting for the ambulance to come to bring me to the hospital. I really don't want to go because like, it's not like, uh, like it doesn't feel like that. But just because like I called my OB and they're like, you know, since you are over 30 weeks, you should go to the hospital and check it out because there's OBs on call there that will um, have, has all the proper tools that will be able to make sure everything's okay. So really I'm just going to make sure everything's okay because obviously it's not normal to be feeling whatever I'm feeling right now at 30 weeks. So hopefully, well maybe it might be normal, but still they're saying to just check it out just in case. So. I've called the ambulance and I'm waiting for the ambulance to come. I have a little backpack just in case for myself. I didn't pack anything for the baby because I'm hoping that the baby ain't ready to come. Uh, but just in case, you know, I do have my mom on speed dial. So if anything, she just gonna have to help me out and grab the rest of the stuff that I'm gonna need. As of right now, I only pack just like a, a change of clothes, some extra underwear and socks. And like my ID. So dear Lord, I hope and I pray that this baby is not coming out right now because it's not your time. So just wait. I'm gonna show you guys a lot of mercy. This is what we're looking like right now. My low, my high. What's going on you guys so it is days later after my little scare that i had when i had to go to the hospital thinking that my baby boy was gonna come early but he behaved himself and he definitely was not coming early um so the reason for that was actually because my ob Jen actually she had put me on some iron supplements because i don't know if i told you guys that my blood pressure was really low and you know um apparently i am anemic um throughout this pregnancy i wasn't anemic before but somehow i'm anemic so she put me on some iron pills um which 
if anybody that knows if you take iron that can cause you to be constipated so pretty much I was constipated and that was the reason as to why I was feeling some cramping pain and the doctor ended up checking my cervix cervix was closed so they ended up just sending me home so yeah <laughs> false alarm guys false alarm <laughs>